Hi, this is Anna. Welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to uh, share with you some of the greeting cards that I have for sale at my Etsy shop. And I thought that it would be a good idea to just point out the detail because it's kind of difficult to see all of that in, uh, in photos that I have on my uh, on those listings. So right now I have Thanksgiving, uh, Halloween, Christmas, and uh, birthday or all occasion cards. And one thing, the option that you see is you can either pick just a card so it will arrive with matching envelope or you can have it in a box so it's like a nice gift box so this is how it would arrive just like that that's a, a card inside so you would re still receive the card and envelope plus the box so the box is just pearly pattern at the back then has this thing, this lining, and clear plastic top. So that's the box. And you would you would see it just like this. So it's a nice gift to just to give somebody a card in a box. So the cards that I have right now, for example, this one. So they're clean inside. They have my stamp at the back. And so the card, this is brown card, and then there is background, orange background. Then there's this background that's embossed. I don't know if you can tell, this is embossed paper. Then this is scrapbooking paper here. Then you have die cut flowers with enamel dots. This is ribbon here. That's also embossed die cut with uh, jute twine or baker's twine. Uh, bow that I made and there is also some uh, twine or something underneath it under this uh, leaf and it's actually risen up a little bit and so is this part it's on those as you can see foamy things so it's background and then this is ephemera and I also added glitter so that's this card then this card, this is white card, so they will come with matching envelopes. This one has background, the orangey, brownish background, cardstock. Then this is embossed paper, this uh, with leaves and stuff. So then you have flower with uh, button center with pearl. This here is lace of white color lace. This also has, the flower has something underneath it, some twine. And the bow that I made, brown bow, this is also the Rick Rick, uh, uh trim. Then this part is risen. I don't know if you can see. Yep, right there. So this is up, this is higher. And this is just ephemera, give thanks, and two buttons. And this is also on a background, brown background. So this one. Then this one. Um, this one actually has this part inside with white paper stamped. It's glued on the side. And so this one has a, two backgrounds, orange background cardstock background then die cut here you can see this die cut then this is uh, trim I just cut out one leaf die cut with a gemstone center this part is risen up it's stamped and it's inked around with orange ink and this pin is also colored green here this is a die cut uh, turkey with die cuts flowers gemstones inside the turkey also has gemstone eyes and this is glitter and i made a bow here now here the yellow thing you see that's ribbon then here's a die cut that's another die cut 
pumpkin and this is a die cut as well and three green color buttons so this green is like this green here so quite a bit of work these cards were now this one background here then I have this background the brown um, checkered cardstock that I used some uh, edge punch here this is orange orange lace this is a uh, kind of like a bow I made with twine and button uh, center this is a piece of um, actually it's a cardstock that I stamped and colored with markers and these are die cuts with gemstone centers so then this is also on the background orange color background and then this is again risen up and it's I just cut this shape and then this and I stamped it we give thanks for all our blessings so that's this one uh, this card is beautiful so brown cardstock on the background then white color cardstock that's punched on both sides then there's another part another color cardstock here right here and then this is burlap so one two three four layers then here you have um, die cut doily die cut pumpkin that i made using oval sizzlets which i inked then i cut this this is a die cut three flowers die cut flowers with gemstone centers now this is background cardstock this is risen up stamped inked around and this is orange lace so it's a lot of stuff this is why i figured i need to make videos of these cards so you can actually see this one white card card stuck dotted then you have this part here punched another part punched white lace again three um, ovals that I mark um, drew around the edges colored the edges kind of then I also see I embossed them and I sprayed them with glitter mist and then this is die cut die cut and this is glued this is also up this part here on a pin and this is glued so that's this one this one is one of my favorite ones so this one has two backgrounds brown and then the polka dot blue color then there is background made with burlap two die cut embossed leaves uh, bow that i made i don't know how you call this part here two buttons here and then this is like a stand or something with the, like a sign we give thanks for our blessing that's stamped so this actually is ribbon this part here is a ribbon very creative of me to put actually a ribbon not cardstock there's another leaf underneath that you just can't see it um so that's die cut these are die cuts and here i made the pumpkin with uh um, circle die cuts and same thing i drew around i embossed them i sprayed them with glitter mist here's another button and this is rickrack this part of the pumpkin the stem is a rickrack so this green here so it's one of my favorite ones 
think it's because of this, but maybe because of this. I don't know. So then let's do let's do the eclectic all occasion can be birthday or something else. So this one this one is on the off-white color card. So there's a background. Then let's see what else. There's another piece that's cardstock piece that's inked around. Then this here is like um what is it called? It's another die cut that's inked around. Then there is a little piece here, cardstock, and these the quotes from Tim Holtz. Then there's flower and another flower with gemstone center. I added the gemstone center. Then you have a beautiful picture frame made with pearls. That's like the sticker pearls. And background is uh, pink and everything is inked. And then this cute sweetheart. This is actually made, the stem of the flower is made with trim, pink trim. Here are actually three flowers together and a gemstone center and I forget how you call these things, this metal clock. And then there's another piece here, pink color and then this is uh, gold color washi and then there's some lace here and the lace here, I don't know if I mentioned that very beautiful then this one again background then Tim Holtz here with cute bow background everything is inked Tim Holtz ephemera inked and then three gemstones make a wish and again cute heart trim here washi here and washi here and then lace lace here and um, four gemstones here same color as this one super cute and then look she's holding flowers and the stem is again made with trim and then three um, flowers applique flowers and this one is Tim Holtz and she has a hairband made with glitter cute bow with gemstone on top then it's one background two uh, gemstones here butterfly 3d butterfly with gemstone center doily underneath all that then mulberry flowers with gemstones and here is again this is believe in yourself cute heart and I put a sequence on the in the middle and then two flowers here with gemstone center and this flower again has a stem so it's like growing with gemstone center as well so there's also I see there's another piece of cardstock so there's like multiple layers of cardstock on each card pretty much okay Halloween. <laughs> so white card, black background, then dotted background, then this cardstock green, that's like a strip of paper right here. Um, then I added black lace, top and bottom. Then this part is risen up again, so this is higher up. Two backgrounds green black and stamped orange background then I made this uh, ribbon bow I added four gemstones in each corner then I have stamped spider here trick-or-treat uh, this is I believe washi the orange trick-or-treat is just uh, from paper pad and this cute thing that's like a plic or something but this is just so adorable so it's 3d2 
cupcake with with witch's hat super adorable then this one um, this one was actually quite a bit of work so how did I make this one multiple backgrounds so there is green white with some print pumpkin so three from what I see now then that's a stamp but I cut the paper here with scissors as you can see the pattern scissors and I inked this with um, purple and orange ink and I put it on white background so that what you see here is white background that's a die cut bat that's like here right here is 3d spider fuzzy spider two flowers here there is a uh, bow made with this twine and I think it was a tag because I can see this part that's a tag so it's a tag underneath it all glued this is ribbon this is die cut this have this paper and I made this broom super cool it's paper this is paper this is I don't know how you call this but look at this broom then these are buttons with twine uh, I tied twine to these buttons and then this is stamped on a purple background so a lot going on you can def you cannot see the spider on a picture so and I also and this is also a die cut this star here so but that's a stamp and I have another one best witches of Halloween so it's cardstock cardstock here then background black background ephemera on top black gemstone this is a uh, ribbon this is bow that i made sequence here black on both sides here and here then this is i made this uh, i printed it out i made it in photoshop best witches of halloween on the background and then this is tag this also gives you ideas what to do with tags and stuff button and this is twine double bow die cuts and black gemstones in the center so this is risen up very pretty too and last two cards 15 cards in this video so this one is brown paper so that is uh, on red background then there's patterned background then this is a uh, ribbon that wraps around the whole thing there this is a die cut stamped this is also die cut and here that's trim or ribbon or whatever you call it that i went around the die cut and i glued that then these are uh <coughs> die cuts these are buttons here and this is rickrack and this is double you cannot see it it's a double bow that i made so this is pretty neat too and then this one is look at that superior quality washable buttons and i have buttons here i made um christmas tree out of buttons so it's background red background then you have this color and then this color cardstock white lace this is um bow that i made with this ribbon and that's on the background so that's ephemera and that's on the background uh, red background and what you can hear is my cat daisy daisy <laughs> so these cards i have available for sale at my shop 
these cards, I was making the cards for a um, store, boutique, shop, and uh, they were selling them for $12, but the store closed. So I have these cards for sale, but I do enjoy making cards. So um, if you're interested in any of these, they're available at my shop, and I'm going to link the uh, greeting card section uh, underneath the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. Um, maybe it gave you some ideas. It would also be great ideas for um, journal covers and stuff or page decorations. So thank you so much for stopping by. Please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.